Hello and welcome to the tutorial on CodeSource HMI. My name is Volker Marx from Kenrin Company and today we will focus on visualizations. Are you looking for a simple visualization for your machine? An intelligent data management with OPC UA integration would also be helpful. Or perhaps you have older CodeSource V2 systems in the field and would like to equip them with the same visualization as the new V3 systems. Of course, cost-effectiveness is also important for the solution. Maybe you also need small control panels for a larger machine, all well connected and programmable from a single PLC. Or you have an intelligent drive or another device with an integrated CodeSys controller and you are looking for a visualization solution for it. Of course, there are countless visualization options available on the market, but in this tutorial I want to give you an overview of the possibilities offered by the CodeSys development system. Firstly, there's a target view. Here, the visualization is located directly on the controller, either on an integrated device like a panel PC, or the display is connected via a graphics interface such as HDMI or DisplayPort. The visualization is created within the CodeSys project for the target view. Then, there's the web view. This one is also created within the CodeSys project, but the display takes place in an HTML-capable browser. The browser needs to be connected to the controller via LAN, so that the access to the data is possible from anywhere. Since the entire screen layout is handled by the controller, the PLC needs to do more computation compared to the target view. However, the advantage is that you can also access the visualization using a mobile device via wireless LAN, as long as the PLC supports wireless, which some of our devices do. And finally, the focus on this video, the HMI visualization. As with web visualization, the controller communicates with the Visio via a LAN connection, but instead of a browser, a special CodeSys runtime system handles the visualization. This means that the image buildup takes place completely on the HMI device and thus relieves the PLC. Only the data of the visualization must be transferred. Let's take a detailed look at the HMI visualization and its advantages. Advantage 1. Since a CodeSys instance runs on the HMI device, it is also possible to write CodeSys program code like complex calculations here, in contrast to web visualization. Or you can connect an RFID reader via a serial interface. Even a small database would not be a problem with the HMI. Advantage 2. The HMI project can be developed as a separate project and would be independent from your CodeSys project. A direct integration into the project is of course also possible. But how to get a HMI solution? On the one hand, there is a single license in the CodeSys store. This is limited to Intel x86 platforms. In our Vico HMI series, which is based on the ARM platform, HMI is already integrated and thus offers a very attractively priced overall solution. And it is exactly this attractive Vico series that I would like to introduce to you in more detail. I would like to start with the basic variant. In terms of design, flexibility and last but not least price, these HMI panels are perfectly suited for a modern operating concept. Standard display sizes here are 4, 7 and 10 inch widescreen, of course with LED backlight. All devices have a resistive touch display in a robust plastic housing. The ARM Cortex-A8 processor with graphics acceleration ensures a very smooth display and the industrial interfaces such as USB, RS-232 or RS-485 enable communications with other devices such as a scanner. For certain applications where a glass front is required and a higher quality design is desired, there is a Wiko Multi-Touch series. It is available in 7, 10 and 15 inch versions and thanks to the modern IPS technology it guarantees a wide viewing angel and high luminosity. The housing consists of an aluminum frame with seamless safety glass. This ensures a high level of robustness in the field. An ARM Cortex-A8 quad-core processor enables even complex visualizations with gesture control. In contrast to the basic series, 
there is a second LAN interface and two USB ports. A RS232 interface for further communication is also available. For more details, data sheets, codes packages and much more, please visit the Kenron website of our product finder. You will find the link below this video. And if you have any further questions, please do not hesitate to contact our product management. Contact details also under this video. We have now reached the end of this tutorial and I would be happy if I could bring technology, concepts and products a little closer to you. And if you need a detailed tutorial on how exactly to create an HMI visualization under Codesys, you will find it in our YouTube channel on the second part of this video. Thanks for watching and until the next tutorial.